Welcome back to Making Magic at Spate Design. Uh, in the past few weeks, we've shown you a few of the projects we've been working on, and I thought it might be interesting to show you the facility that we're in. Uh, this is our new building. Uh, it's the home of Spate Design. After 60 years, we finally got smart and bought a building. Uh, we bought it almost one year ago. It took about six months of renovation, so we moved in here in March, and uh, love to show you. So come on in. We're going to move quickly through the office, not much to show here yet, um, but uh, we're going to go into the studio and unfortunately can't show you a lot of the projects we're working on yet. Um, they're confidential, they're Christmas windows for many of the New York stores, but uh, we'll give you a little glimpse of it and you can you know, see the space. This building had originally been a parking garage for Hostess Brands. One of their brands was Wonder Bread. And when we uh, acquired the building, it had a big sign on the outside that said, Wonder. Uh, Quinn O'Sullivan, our production director, started referring to this building as the Wonder Factory. It seems appropriate for what we do. So uh, we have sort of adopted it, and uh, its name has sort of stuck. So this is the Wonder Factory. Standing here this morning with Ryan Murphy. He's our CNC expert. Uh, good morning, Ryan. How's it going? Excellent. How are you? Good. Uh, could you tell us what CNC stands for, particularly since you're in, uh, in charge of the CNC router? Hopefully I can answer that question. Uh, it's computer number controlled, so computerized. Uh. And what basically does that uh, do for us here? Well, uh, for example... The things that we used to do were all by hand, and now that we can import information into the computers, design it all on screen, we can then take that, transport that to the router, and cut out a wild variety of things that would have been far too time consuming otherwise if we had tried to do them by hand, which means we couldn't have done them in the time frame and budgets that we work with without the computer number controlled router. This is a vaulted uh, force perspective subway tile ceiling that our lead designer, Nico, dreamed up. And I don't know where he comes up with these things, but it's going to look fantastic. I'm excited about it. In this case, he's done the vast majority of the work. All I have to do is figure out how to cut this so it looks like how he wants it and figure out where all the seams are going to be so that they're hidden. Uh, but he's given me the vast majority of the work already on this particular project. I can just kind of get it done. Thanks, Ryan.